So guys, today I'm going to be doing a review on the Square bottle. Now I want to do the review on this bottle because one, I actually like it as a bottle, and two, when I did my uh, bottle survival kit earlier this week, you guys actually had a large uh, kind of uproar. You guys want to know more about this bottle, where you could get this bottle. You guys really wanted to get one. So I figured I'd do a review and kind of share my thoughts on this bottle in particular and not just as the survival kit bottle. So now, without any further ado, let's move over to the table. So, so as I mentioned before, today I'm going to be doing a review on this square bottle, or the Triton Square by Clean Bottle, is technically its name. And uh, I'm going to be going over the table, the few things that I really like about this bottle, and some of the things I don't like about this bottle. And the, f the first thing I really, really like about this bottle is probably not something you'd expect me to like. And uh, it's not the fact that it's square, it's not the fact that it opens from both sides, but it's actually the fact that these uh, caps here are really my favorite thing. And the reason why they're my favorite is uh, because they are half turned. If you guys notice, this is it locked and this is it unlocked. It's only a half turn. Now, I'm not really sure why people like Nalgene, Clean Canteen, Camelback, all the other really big names in bottle making, they never did this, but I'm not really sure why that is, but that doesn't really matter because Clean Bottle did it and they did it really well. And I actually really like this feature for two reasons. Firstly, because firstly because unlike with this uh, Nalgene, I'll try and show this here, but unlike the Nalgene, when you set the cap on here, because this only has, you guys can see how little uh, the screw actual piece of this is, it sits really deep. And this is really nice because when you're walking, especially with a rather full bottle, inherently the bottle will tend to bounce and shake, and that can make it a little bit frustrating to get the cap started. But because this cap sits already at full depth, it's very, very easy to screw. So not only that, but like I said, this whole half twist here, I mean, it only takes a half twist to open or close this bottle. And I really like that feature because it just makes getting uh, a quick drink really easy. You know, all you have to do is that and it's off. There's none of this screwing it you know twice like with this Nalgene you have to screw it you know two complete rotations before it comes off and like I was saying with it you can see how this likes to jiggle hopefully you guys can see that I know this black on black is not the best but uh, hopefully you can see that you know it likes to jiggle and like I said because you have to screw it two full rotations it's a lot more complicated when it's full and you know it's shaking you're walking or you're moving and you know this is shaking itself so I really, really like that whole fact that like I said, it's just that half twist and that it sits on there so deep. The second part is probably more rational and you know, something that you would have seen coming. And my second favorite part of this is the fact that it does open from both sides. I do want to note as well that both sides are half click and something else I do like, this is kind of a side note, is with this bottle cap in particular, because it's a removable, like I jury rigged this one to be, um, it actually sits really nicely. You can see how they have it uh, made here so that when you set it on the ground, it sets your actual interface with the top of this bottle really high up to hopefully prevent it from getting garbage in there. So I do really like that. But like I was saying, I like the fact that it opens from both sides. That makes cleaning it extremely easy. It also makes it really nice because if you're like me and you like to drink uh, different types of drinks that may have you know, particulates or whatever in them, uh, all of that stuff tends to settle at the bottom of the bottle, and the bottom of the bottle is right here, and so all that will essentially be trapped right here. So all those particulates will be essentially trapped right there where you can just go and clean them really easily. As well, if there is any, you know, more additional garbage sitting on this bottom lip here, you know, it's really easy to go in and just clean it. Unlike with a normal conventional bottle like that one, like the Nalgene here, you know, it's very hard. You have to use like a specialized brush and, you know, you have to get in there. It's far more time consuming and a lot more challenging to clean the bottom of that bottle as opposed to this one. So I really like that feature of this And bottle. then lastly, I do really like the whole square, uh, 
squareness of this bottle. It is nice because one, it doesn't look like another bottle, uh, but it really does sit very cleanly. Something I really like is even if you do like to set your bottles up normally like this, like most of us do, especially like in vehicles, I've noticed this, that you know, sometimes, or say you hit a bump, you know, and the bottle ends up going on its side, unlike this bottle that will just roll under like your seat or something, this bottle generally just sits, you know, it hits the ground and just sits like this, you know, without rolling off to a side or being annoying. So I really appreciate that factor a lot. Um, other things I like about it is it does come with a lifetime warranty and this, I really like this top cap. Some people may not like how obnoxious it is, but I find even with mittened hands here, you can see that because this opening is so large, you can normally put all four of your fingers in here. Obviously with mittens, it doesn't quite work, but <clears throat> you can obviously get a very secure grip and easily pop it open. So those are the things I really like about the bottle. Now onto some of the things I, I think don't I like really about dislike about this bottle, and you'll notice it on here is graduation. Something that is missing from this bottle, I'll even rotate it all the way around just so you can see, is there is absolutely no graduations. And while it isn't a deal breaker because all my stainless steel bottles don't have graduations either, I feel like on especially a translucent plastic bottle, you should really have uh, graduations. It's a great way to monitor or meter your water consumption, how much you've consumed, how much you need to consume, whatever you normally do, but it is definitely missing on this one and I would have highly appreciated somewhere on here having a full graduation showing, you know, how much water is in here because I know this bottle entirely as a whole carries 25 ounces, but that that's all I know. I don't know anywhere in between, but I just know that a full bottle is 25 ounces, but that's it. I don't know anything more. So I really dislike that part of it. Uh, another thing I dislike, and it's not so much a problem with this bottle in particular, but what, rather with the Triton Square bottles, is that is that there's not really any other options but 25 ounces. And I think 25 ounces at times can be a little bit too little for, you know, especially going out into the woods and hiking and backpacking. I think you would really want more water than that. I mean, like I said, I've been using this as an everyday carry bottle, and 25 ounces isn't that bad. Uh, you know, I just have to go and refill the bottle more frequently than I would this bottle or, you know, a larger bottle. So I would really love to see preferably like a 50 ounce square bottle would be really cool. But for the time being, they only have the 25 ounce, which is, I think, like I said, the largest downside to this bottle, in my opinion. Secondly, so those are really the only two downsides I have with it. Um, some improvements I would love to see is what I think would actually be really cool, especially for outdoorsmen, would be if Clean Bottle could make a 50 ounce version of this and then find a way to make this cap, you know, like fix on this cap a water purifier. Because what I would love to do with this, especially a 50 ounce one, is like go to a pond, you know, using the bottom of this bottle, you know, scoop up some pond water, hopefully, you know, like have cloth protecting it from any large particulates. But, you know, have a piece of cloth here and just scoop up pond water Then you know, close this, shake it or do whatever you need to do to purify the water and then drink out of this top part. I think that would be really awesome. I think if Square wanted to go more towards outdoorsmen, using this bottom piece as different things for outdoorsmen would be really, really cool. I think there's a lot of different creative ideas you could put on these bottoms. And I think that would be a really great place to go, especially if they wanted to continue to sell to outdoorsmen. I think that would be a great idea, especially, like I said, making this a 50 ounce would be far more attractive than this little 25 ounce uh, bottle. But anyways, those are my thoughts on the square, uh, sorry, the Triton Square by Clean Bottle. I keep just wanting to call it a square bottle, but it's the Triton Square by Clean Bottle. And uh, in the description below, I will have a link to this on Amazon where you can get it if you would like one. I guess another downside to them, I would say probably the only other downside, is they are a little pricey in the fact that you can get this bottle over here, this Nalgene, sorry, I can't really point with the uh, mittens, but the Nalgene you can get for like 8 bucks on Amazon, and this square is about 14 bucks. So, you know, it sucks a little bit, but this is a really awesome bottle. And I really just want to give a large kudos to 
clean bottle for really thinking outside the box especially being a gear maker myself you know it's really easy to get stuck in tradition you know this is how we've made bottles for thousands of years you know but clean bottle said no they wanted to make a square bottle that was really effective and i think they really accomplished it with this design i think this works very well and you know once again you know we get caught up in the tradition of these bottles you know only having one opening hole whereas with you know clean bottle once again they had that bottom opening hole for ease of cleaning they really thought of the user and making the bottle more user friendly and i really wanted to just give them a large kudos for that because like i said this is how we've been making bottles for thousands of years and then these guys come along and make something really awesome so yeah there are definitely kinks in the system System, but overall I think it's a really great bottle anyways guys don't forget to comment like share and subscribe and tell me what your thoughts are on this square bottle and let me know if you guys go get one and what your thoughts are on yours uh, you can get these in a bunch of different colors do keep in mind mine just is blue just like this Nalgene um, but you can get them in many different colors you can even get them in different colors like these little end caps you can get them in different colors but anyways guys that's it for now and I'm out